Well, we are finally back to running beans. We messed around all morning getting things serviced up and getting the switch back over. Had to work on some stirrators for a while. And letting on beans dry. We've had a beautiful day, not a cloud in the sky, which we've been needing. And as much as I like shelling corn, I'm glad to be back on beans. Because November 5th, yeah, November 5th is getting kind of late. We need to be getting them run. And I didn't figure conditions would get ideal, but this isn't too bad. It's about 2 o'clock. We just got up here. We ate some lunch and I went one pass down and I'm getting this little bit and this field's done. And the rest of this field was done. Well, it's been two and a half weeks since we've run beans at least. And this is just where we started having problems, so we quit. And then we got to go drive down the road with the head on a quarter of a mile down to the other side of the woods. So there's a 13 acre field left. My uncle had his new 760 combine over here yesterday running checking a sample while we shelled corn and he had a shaft speed issue with that so he took it to home to a shop which is next road over and his service guy was coming to do that so we've got two fields left to go on this farm and then we'll be moving so we'll knock them out hopefully this afternoon get moved to the next one and get a chunk a big chunk of that done 230 foot combines ought to make some beans disappear today if we can get them both running and everything goes good. Well, we've moved to the next farm. Ben and I are out here. We're shutting her down for the night because they're just not feeding very well. We're going to take stuff over here and park it and run my uncle semi back to his place. My uncle and DJ there shuffling equipment around right now. D's got the fire lit in here. Uh huh. D's got the fire lit in okay. here. That's good. Yes, it is nice and warm. Left my coat at the farm. Yeah. Both of mine are in the mines in the red tractor. And then, uh. Pulling into the field here where we quit last night. And I'm gonna start my combine and get it warming up. And DJ's. And I are going to run up to where we were before here and get our grain cart because he got it emptied this morning. So I'll stop and fill the beans, see how dry they feel too while we're here. I think my uncle's getting ready to move his combine up here, so we'll be running too and get things knocked out pretty quick. Well, my uncle just got here and got head on his 760 and he's running. I'm getting the last little dab of these rows over. Here finished up. Our, our map isn't going to be filled in very well because we've got two machines running and one's Green Star and one's Case system. So and at least we'll be able to compare. I know I well, he might not have a map. His receiver and everything got messed, got smashed in the accident. So I don't even know if he'll be mapping or not. He'll probably have an instant shield, but I doubt he's
umbrella who was way out on the field. Well, ours is broke. They uh, crank somehow. The